Oh, I know he usually does go somewhat back and forth to John, somewhat leaning in John's favor just a little bit. And this is a matchup where if Inkling can't find the kill, which sometimes she can, it can be really good for Lucario, but that's also considering that John learned how to do up throw up air, which he probably hasn't. No offense, John. Sorry if you watch this back. But please learn how to do that. It's really good. But opening up with the 56%, you find the jab lock. But that's just more juice for Vivi. And he is really good at thriving off uh, having the aura. Like any any normal Lucario, I mean, would, would you know? But Vivi especially. The mash? Just gonna live by the skin of his teeth. And now Vivi is like Super Saiyan. And yeah, and you, you hear it in the aura sphere too. So he's not gonna overcommit. With the aura sphere buff, he, you'll definitely see him sitting back a lot more, uh, throwing them out, because it's, I think it's just bigger and it comes out faster. And that was a calm 22%, keeping it trailing. Nice back here by John Numbers to get out of that situation. And something I saw VB do earlier today actually was do Warp Sphere to up air, opting for the back air there. Good situational awareness. Nice side B. Is that your stock? So close. Wow, that was so nuts. That move is so cool aesthetically, mind you. <laughs> Wow, and right now, I just feel like Vivi has, has just been in control for the past 25 seconds. Like, winning most of the exchanges, that's your stock. You cannot... Oh, unless unless you're bad. <laughs> unless you just miss. And the back air exploding. All the percent that John eats right now, if any, is just going to be on, on that one exchange. Nice tech coming out from Vivi. Not going to get the red sparks just yet. Nice positioning, too. Getting right outside that inkling range. And it can be really... Okay, please don't mess this up. Yeah, you're dead. <laughs> it can be really tricky to get out of Inkling's range, considering that like their dash is so, 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 so good. John just taunted. Okay. Uh, <laughs> God. We out here, yo. The truth is we out here. Both players getting pretty at 2-2 two, two stocks. John gonna strike first. Up throw up air. Nice. Ooh, almost a good text by VD, but a little slow on the mark. That could have been huge. You could have pressed his advantage harder, but right now, pressing his advantage regardless. I'm liking how something I like about VD is that like when he finds like a small confirm, he like leads into a lot of damage. It's like it's like light-esque kind of play, like the fox, but not as crackhead-wise. <laughs> Ooh, nice that smash punish. Most multi-jabs in this game, unless your fox, have like a lot of end lag. Oh, that was a misinput. That could have been a back air. But, nice. Gonna outspace the, uh, the falling forward air. Really good textbook stuff by BB. John looking for a ledge trap. Dashing back, trying to catch the, uh, the aggressive option, but a little slow on the mark there. Ooh, nice. I like how VB didn't tech there. Because something Inklings like to do a lot is that they they want you to tech because they can roller and kill you accordingly, and John is like the roller Inkling. All right, F smash, not gonna find it. John jumping out of harm's way. Ooh, that's your stock. Yep, yeah, F smash, you're done. All right, 60%, nothing Inkling can't make up. Definitely with some, some splatter shot, some multi jabs. Some up airs, of course, right now. Wow, a calm 42% coming out from uh, John Numbers. VV with your retaliation. Holy shoot, I cannot talk. Back throw. John in a scary spot right now. Let's see what VV can do with it. stuff. That, wow, okay. That was really, really good. <laughs> good stuff. He, 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 he conditioned that uh, like on so many different levels because he's been understanding like John's defensive habits. Oh my god, I want to watch this back. That was so beautiful. Alright, so obviously uh VB conditioned to the shield there because that, or I mean, he conditioned to roll because John has been doing that every time. 
And that is such a good option coming out from uh, VB. And, you know, punching accordingly, of course. Good stuff. Taking game one. I think they're going to go back to PS2 because John is always that kind of player. Just run it back. Oh, this is some good music right now. I'll be out here. Uh, right now, seeing the same old song and dance as usually do. Uh, John gonna wanna uh, uh, weave in and out a lot. And BB gonna wanna punish accordingly. Uh, forward air, up air, nice little conversion from BB. Nice. See, he's not teching that because he knows John can just, uh, get so much more if he does. But right now, I feel like BB can't really find an answer to. To, how do I say this? You can't really find the answer to how John is taking an aerial approach to most of these situations. It just feels like John can do a rising there for free, fall off a short hop. And Vivi just can't really punish due to Lucario's tools being not that good for like certain areas like that. And him just not positioning himself where he should be. Dash attack, gonna stop out the option. Nice horse to cover smash. Nair. Ooh, that could have been a side B, I feel like. VB gonna play equally as evasive as John is right now. Nice, right there he had the right idea. Just a, just John being so aware to jump out of the way. Cause he knew, he, cause John knew VB wanted him to land there, which is huge. Up air, nice up air chase coming out from John. And winner of this gets guaranteed fifth place. And with the way Zeno's been going right now, like no one wants to take a dip into losers. That's a scary bracket. Ooh, looking for the second mash on his, on his block, but John's just gonna reset the situation and punish him. Wow, he was frames off from not losing that stock. Good stuff to BB. Shopping coming out from John, understanding where VV wants to wants to retreat to to get back to the stage. Side B. That's not going to be your life, but that's a lot of damage. But the way VV's looking right now, that could be your stop. So scary coming out. B with the let's trap. Oh my god. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> this is so fun to watch. Nice up air. Wow. That was like a cloud esque up air. He gave him the foot. <laughs> Jeez Louise. All right. This is. Is this VV's game to lose? Or will he come out on top? We'll have to see. Only time will tell. And he has to hold on to his aura. This is. If he gets this, he gets fifth place, which is like really good for VV. Right now. Ooh. Nair. Not going to find the conversion. John is struggling right now. Because the, the longer this goes on, the harder it gets for him. Back throw, that's a setup for the ledge trap. But Vivi gonna go on stage. That has like minimal lag right now. Uh, uh, they buffed that move a, a ton from Smash 4. Vivi sitting at a, at a pretty 175. All he needs is a back air, a side B, a sneeze, you name it. But nice down tilt two frame from John. And all of a sudden he's right back in this. And this is gonna be much harder if, because this is a posi position where VV wants to have a little damage. Right now it's perfect. If he can just stay in this general range, a percent, well, it's climbing right now. He is looking so pretty to win this right now. But John, ooh. John doesn't want that to happen. I feel like that could have been a counter on the bomb, but the timing is just so strict. A B. Ooh, this is so scary right now. Looking for a jump. I feel like that could have been up the upper percent. Well, oh my god, that's it. That's it. VV guaranteed fifth place. Moving on to winter semis. And I think I have to play right now. I do gotta play right now. Alright, see you.